I had 47 members before me saying that we don't want to support this government. We want to withdraw support from this government. That is itself an enough ground in my respectful submission. Your lordships were pleased to record, my lord, several past cases where the governor either decided to direct flow test, parties came here and your lordships did not intervene, or governor was not directing flow test, parties came here, and when required sitting at midnight, your lordships directed that immediate flow test. And the only purpose was that there is no time for either pressure, threat, coercion, violence, allurement, etc., etc. Whatever is the will should be reflected at the first available opportunity. Therefore, your lordships were not set at night in case of Karnataka. There are several such instances. So that's, therefore, I was saying that you should not only command the majority support at the time of formation of the government, you must continue to command that. That's the democracy. So it is only in extraordinary circumstances that there would be a departure from flow test rule. Otherwise, flow test is the rule. Well, that's what, my lord, the test, your lordships were pleased to lay down. Because when we say, my lord, that defection is the highest political sin, Lord, running a government after losing the confidence of the electorate, namely the house, is a larger constitutional scene to which governor should not be a party. Continuous existence of that trust gives you the legitimacy in democracy. Lord, now this is, uh, 11 is important. Lord, the argument was that floor test could not have been ordered because they, this side and other independents, etc., who withdrew support from the government, they should have gone for no confidence motion. And this is a new point, my lord, which I would be urging for your lordship's consideration, not argued, my lord, so far. First of all, my lord, whether it is a floor test, which is a motion of confidence or a no confidence motion, my lord, which is negatively worded, the result is the same. And therefore, that can never be a ground to invoke your lordship's equity jurisdiction in a 226. Flow test also, the numbers will be counted and people would decide whether I have the majority. In no confidence, numbers will be counted and members would decide whether I have the majority. But there is something more than that. Lord, please come to PDF page 40 of Convenience Compilation 3C. Lord, the provision in the Maharashtra Legislative Assembly rules regarding no, no confidence motion. Lord, your lordships are confront, confronted with a situation where the governor is receiving representations that we have withdrawn support, we want to withdraw support, etc., etc. I am not repeating. There is a threat of violence. There is, in fact, violence. Attacks are taking place at the houses. And now, my lord, the submission is that you should have allowed the no confidence route rather than directing a floor test. Your lordships have said, my lord, please bear in mind that such floor test cannot brook any delay. And why this reliance on no confidence motion? Maybe they wanted more time, which the governor prevented them from doing. Para 90, well, rule 95. Your lordships have that? Rule 95? Yes. Well, two things I'll say at the outset and I'll read this. First, I can, any member can move a no confidence motion only when house is in session, not otherwise. House was not in session. Number two, it depends upon the discretion of the speaker whether to allow the motion to be placed or tabled or not. It's not a right. So again, I'll be dependent upon the discretion to be used by the speaker if I'm the elected representative. This is what, well, therefore, governor says that, no, you hold a session. So first, he can sit for one week to decide whether to permit this or not. But if he admits, then the members will seek leave to make the motion for uh, on such day, not later than two days after it is admitted. If the assembly is in session, as the speaker may appoint, after questions and before the list of business for the day is entered upon. So when the assembly is in session, this can be done with the speaker. There is no time limit fixed. He can decide to admit it after a week. And thereafter, if the assembly is in session, we can the members can say two days. So, the, so next session may be after 15 days, after one month, after five months. We do not know. Your lordships are deciding this constitutional principle that whether the governor was right in directing 
summoning of the house for floor test and they are saying that no no confidence motion was the root meaning thereby this threat allurement violence etc etc continues and the governor's satisfaction that prima facie the government has lost confidence would continue without any legitimacy Lord, borrowing a lot shifts very very Lord, pertinent expression after the member has asked for leave of the assembly to make the motion the speaker shall read the motion to the assembly and request those members who are in favor that's the procedure Lord, uh, how the motion would be passed or failed so Lord, this is no remedy in fact situation like this because you have the, the test followed right from the state of Rajasthan till Shivraj Singh Chauhan is, it cannot brook any delay. The last three points. Another option was 356, which is frowned upon, and nobody, that, that has to be the last resort. And how that happened, please come to Malod as a last submission. My Malod, written uh, the documents which I have placed. Malod, we received, the governor received two letters that now Eknath Shinde has the majority. And Malod, Another very risky argument which uh, uh, Mr. Sibyl made that why did the governor call Eknath Shinde to form the governor and why not the president of the party was consulted? My Lord, the governor knows only the elected leader of the house. He is not concerned with political parties. There are political parties where leader of the house is in fact the leader and president is not controlling him from somewhere else. Governor has to contact the lead, elected leader of the legislative party. When he, he, he is shown, I, I'll show Malod, those documents. There are two letters, Malod, I'll show that document. Because Malod, every party has a different structure. Kindly see Malod, the uh, mischief in this argument. I'm saying argument, not mischief in making of the submission. Malod, in, I'm, uh, no, no, mischief. I, I'm sorry, Malod. I, I thought Malod, it might, might be very relieved with your clarification. No, no. I, it was a, a not correctly worded, Malod. The, the potential mischief if this argument is Malod, accepted. That's what I wanted to convey. Malod, every party has a different party infrastructure. In, for example, in some parties, the highest authority is the general secretary. There is a Politburo in Communist Party. General secretary is the highest authority. In some, Malod, there is a body. Five people, Malod committee or something. In some, there is a president. There may be a dispute who is the president. Governor would not enter into that. Governor would say that who is the leader of the legislative party. Governor would deal with only leader of the legislative party and Mr. Uddhav Thakre, who did not face the confidence and therefore he resigned, is not even a member of the legislative assembly. Provided links to videos where Mr. So and so has openly stated that dead bodies would come, and I would Malo, earnestly urge Malo, not to condone this. Malo, this is a threat in public platform. Malo, let us not Malo, uh, lessen the gravity of it. It's, it's a very serious thing. I leave it at that. I leave it at that. Law and order situation. I leave it. No, Malo, it's, it can be law and order situation also, but if that law and order situation is being created to bring pressure on the legislative process, then it's not just a law and order situation. It is one of the major consideration for the governor that, yes, he seems to have lost majority and now open threats are being administered that you come in our fold or you will be sent to post-mortem. It's a threat to death. I would unless they request your lordship, my lord, that it, it, it cannot be taken serious well, lightly by the constitution. But that I leave it a ground for unseating a for unseating a government. I mean ultimately that somebody who makes that sorry. it is subject to section 156.3 is subject I'm, to I'm uh, an FIR. I'm, you can do what you want about that. Uh, allow me to Malod, put it differently. Malod, that's where the perception differs. If I say that because somebody is threatening, you face the floor test, then your lordships are right. But when I have the letters that we have, we, we want to withdraw support and we are being threatened, then it's not that reason, that's the ground, not the reason. The trust vote, what is the purpose of the trust vote? In a, in a house of 288, do you have 144, that's the purpose. And if there is nothing to indicate that 144 is disturbed, that is, who will lead those 144 is alien to the governor? It may not have been Uddhav Thakre, they could have elected somebody else. The, the uh, INC, NCP and the SENA would have, and the SENA would have said, oh, we are electing somebody else. 
would you, would your losses come to page 21 there is a direct that that is a matter of internal party discipline you see that can never be a matter for the governor governor's trust vote is where the majority in the house is shaken and where was there anything to indicate they say we don't wish to support this government meaning no, mr mehta if you will look at para 11 that's the conclusion we demand security that's all they don't say we are party company where do they say that Lord. they say please give us adequate security as also our Lord. family because it's Lord, the governor is not my lord a court where this prayer was not couched in this manner he has to based upon the material before him oh, no. arrive mr mehta what what is being pointed out to you right what is being pointed out it is this communication cannot be said to be withdrawing the support to mr uddhav thakre this is that what happened it, earlier what, what happened that, that with what it says it it may may say they give us protection but they say we no longer want to be a part of this corrupt government meaning thereby 47 they, and, people are minus now and they, they from the magical say, mark what is being pointed out then then thereafter they uh, they don't say further that henceforth correct we are not supporting this it is a petition the, there is no prayer for the set, subjective satisfaction for that yeah please no note one difference it's not legislative party members showing lack of confidence in their party it's not their internal party affairs anymore these members are saying that we are withdrawing support from the government malot that's the distinction and malot i would hasten to add malot that this not being malot a petition or a suit may not have a prayer clause etc but governor malot as i will from show from one para of bomai from whatever material if he comes to the prima facie satisfaction and that test is accepted by my lords malot in the shivraj singh chauhan judgment that there is loss of confidence by this government then he can ask not only can ask he should ask the floor test 47 members of the legislative assembly not just shiv sena mlas but independents and two members of prahar jan shakti party saying we are withdrawing support from the government no it's past and continuous also that we have already declared that we don't want to support but now we are being pressurized to support that's what you know kindly see and i'll show you para 393 bomai from whatever material he comes to a prima facie conclusion that there needs to be a floor test you know he would be under an obligation we don't want to support this government and therefore give us security because we are being threatened second you know what is the fact situation before the governor one set of mlas namely 49 for 47 saying that we want to withdraw support from the government one set of mla mlas you know or the leaders of the party saying that we will see when you come on the floor of the house in my respectful submission i'm posing a question to myself would the government not be just governor not be justified in forming an opinion that the governor that the government has lost confidence i am not saying anything i am not preempting anything as mr sorab ji you know narrated several possibilities i am only asking for the floor test maybe they might change their view maybe they might uh, sacrifice themselves maybe they stand disqualified maybe they uh, they are persuaded maybe the leadership uh, changes there are several possibilities the governor malot in my respectful submission malot will have no jurisdiction once he has a material and what can be the material apropos her leadership's question it need not be a later also you know suppose in a given set of circumstances it's in public media everywhere which cannot be disputed all channels are showing something but i'm posing a question to myself malot can the governor not examine those facts also but ultimately he is not just you know when a 174 175 situation arises he is not supposed to be a mute spectator he will have to act his action would be subject to judicial review within you know the parameters which your lord chief have fixed you know for my lord you know the future assistance my lord justice you know, and lok prahari and these uh, 17 M- uh, independent mlas were backing the government up to then yes yeah, yes Seven, seven, my lord. Seven, seven, seven. Not seven. It need not be a prayer that please hold a floor test, etc., my lord. People are telling him that he, the the government has is not enjoying our support. They they have lost the confidence, my lord. Here I am being asked by the person who did not choose to face the vote of no confidence that why did you call for the vote of confidence? Why did you call for the floor test? The converse situation and more drastic, my lord, in terms of the facts. 
So, my lord, it's not his right, it's his obligation. And, my lord, the threshold in my respectful submission is that some material which creates a doubt in his mind. And, my lord, I would, my lord, at the cost of repetition and with profound respect, my lord, please, this is a constitutional submission, don't, don't my lord, misunderstand the submission. My lord, the threshold of your lordship's judicial review, which I am not disputing, would be whether there was any material, whether based upon that material, your lordships may perhaps